Okay, Irish. A uh, quick little tip here. Uh, these graves only require two water. The ponds give uh, two water to the square next to them, and then one to the square next to it. So if you got rid of, say, this pond, and this pond, and this pond, and put a pond here, you would have two water here that you needed, and it would provide another water here, bringing this square to a total of two. And because of the way the water works, you get uh, water out here also. So this would also get the same as in the middle here. So you get a couple more squares worth of uh, uh, grapes to work with. And then using what you learn there from uh, how to judge where to place your ponds, you can clean up this area and uh, optimize it. And uh, for all this open area in here, go ahead and plant or put down ponds and put down grapes. They might grow slower, but they'll still grow. You know, after a while, that adds up, especially early game. Okay, so your water boys here, they take uh, three water, or they need three water. These uh, marshes give one. So you got two marshes there. So if you put a pond here, then uh, that would give it another two. So that would bring you to your three for each of your uh, water facilities there. And they'll run it full speed. And uh, with the uh, water facility running at full speed, you may only need one of them. And if, you, if that's the case, I would move this road up to here so you can keep your uh, power plant running. And I would move your lumber mill to where that road was. Right there. So that... He will get the uh, passive water from the pump that he needs, and he'll get passive power from the uh, power plant. And then he'll only be waiting on wood to work on with. Oh, another tip here is uh, with your water facility. If you uh, replace the building on the end here or the one that's uh, a little bit further up. Ah, there we go. There then they'll get the full water they need from the uh, river here. And then that would free you up more room over here for grapes. Uh, when you're doing a grape rush, you don't really need a whole lot of uh, lumber. So, you know, moving that lumber mill down there would probably do you just fine. You probably don't need to uh, make sure your lumber mill and your wood's close together. If you're done making ponds and everything, I would get up rid of the uh, windmill here until you're, and because uh, it'll slow down, it'll provide uh, wind block and shade and stuff and slow down your grapes. Okay, that should be enough to get you headed in the right direction.